Hey guys, this is going to be a quick Titanfall video on my Titan loadouts. Um, I'm going to try to get this below 10 minutes, hopefully. Um, anyways, to jump into the video, uh, let's go to my Titan loadouts and see what I got. Uh, first one is the Art Cannon. The Art Cannon is my favorite gun overall. Um, of all the Titan weapons. Uh, capacitor, I believe, is the best only, I think it's the only attachment you can put on it, yeah. It's it's really good, I think. The capacitor helps a lot. The capacitor is also the arc cannon with the capacitor. This, class, this whole class right here is the class that I use to do the Gooster Challenge. And I had to do the Gooster Challenge before the update. Um, props to everybody that did it before the update. Um, I, 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 sh I think they should have left it there because it's called a challenge for a reason. So I just kind of I was kind of upset when they changed it. But um, anyways, start off on the primary weapon, the arc cannon with capacitor. Um, the arc cannon is good in many ways. It's good for damage. Also, it's good as if somebody's shooting missiles at you and you can shoot the missiles in the air, and it'll bounce from one missile to the other and destroy them all. Uh, the Arcan does a lot of damage. It's a medium to short range gun. It's not really a long range gun, but because it, it, does, it doesn't reach far enough if you're long range. But it's, it's good medium to short range gun. I think it's, I, I basically think it's a built medium range gun. Because it's not very good unless you take off the capacitor for short range. But I love the capacitor, it does more damage and everything. So yeah, to start off with the uh, tactical ability, it's Particle Wall, Ordnance is Cluster Missiles, and then my two tiers are Fast Auto Loader and Core Accelerator. Uh, this is basically everything that I use for every class, uh, except for the close range classes, which I'll get to that soon. Uh, my next class is the Ogre again, because the Ogre is my favorite. And it's just, I just think it's the best one out of all of them. Uh, it's the 40mm cannon with extended mags. The 40mm cannon is the only Titan weapon in the whole game that can destroy a Titan completely in one clip. Um, they, already, they already degraded or downgraded the, uh, the ammo size, like the clip size, once. From I think it used to be 20, now it's 12. But you could still destroy a whole Titan in one clip. Uh, I don't like the free burst on it. Uh, I don't think it does. I don't think it does enough damage. Extended mags is what I think is the best. Particle wall again, cluster missile, fast auto loader, and cork accelerator. Some people like the cluster missile. Some people like the multi-target system. I think the multi-target system is not good whatsoever. I don't think it does enough damage. Especially since most people use ogres in this game. Uh, it just doesn't do enough damage unless you're going against a Strider or an Atlas. And so yeah. Um, the Cluster Missile does the most damage out of all of them I think. Especially if you get them into a corner or something. You can shoot them and the, must, the Cluster Missiles will go all over them and completely demolish them. Um, <clears throat> uh, Tears again, fast auto loader, core accelerator. And then my next one, uh, quad rocket with rapid fire. Everybody loves this class. Everybody uses this class before. Everybody has used this class. It's a good class. Strider with quad rockets with rapid fire is probably the most OP class in this game. Um, what to get with particle wall, cluster missiles, fast auto loader, and big punch this time. Uh, the reason I don't use Big Punch for these two, or these two, or I use it for this one, or this one, is because these two are distance classes. Um, these are far range classes, meaning in the far range you're not going to be close up with these two classes. But with this one, you're going to be constantly on somebody's, on somebody, and you, if you run out of ammo, you can just punch them, I mean, and then you can get your distance away from them, and you can reload it. Um, that's what I think for all close range weapons, you have to use Big Punch because it, it, it saves your life. 
Um, another class that I have is the chain gun with accelerator. Uh, the chain gun is a good gun for the Gooser Challenge also, but I think the Arc Cannon was the best. I just I, think, I thought it was easier. Um, the chain gun with accelerator is a short range gun, I think, but if you just do chain gun with extended mags, I think it's a medium range weapon. But if you're gonna put accelerator on, which I think the accelerator completely demolishes people, uh, you need a it's it's close range for sure. Uh, once again, tactical ability is particle wall, cluster missiles, fast unloader, and big pumps this time because, like I said before, it's going to be a close range gun, so you need big punch on. Uh, that's basically, this is one of my, actually one of my favorite classes. This one, the 40mm and the arc cannon. Another one is the triple threat. I need to change that to big punch. But, triple threat, it's not, it's a, it's a, it's a good gun. It's just, it's, it's just really weird to use. Uh, extended mags, the, the, the mines on it, the minefield is completely trash. I don't know, I do not like that whatsoever. They actually have to walk over it for it to blow up, which I don't think people are that stupid. Um, tactical ability, all the same. Particle wall, cluster missile, stats, all loader, and big punch. Um, if this, if this was, I can't make a another class where I would show you the, uh, oh, I can show you it still, the plasma railgun. Um, extended mags, that's a good way to use it. It's not, it's probably my least favorite gun in the game, that's why I didn't have an actual class for it. Uh, particle wall again, I would use that. Cluster missiles, fast auto loader, and this time, once again, core accelerator. Core accelerator, since it's going to be a distance long gun, it, it just, it just needs that extra core ability if somebody tries to flank you or something and somebody just knocks down your damage it's easier you're going to be from a distance so you're going to be alive more than the other titans so your core accelerator your core accelerator will go up over time and you'll have that ability and that's the exact reason why i use it for these ones too is because you stay alive longer than the others and your core accelerator will get your core ability to come up faster by shooting other people from a distance but, uh, but yeah, I'm, uh, I got this video done under 10 minutes, which I'm pretty proud of myself. I did this video a little bit earlier, and I had it 15 minutes, so that's kind of why I rushed through everything. Uh, but yeah, uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my Titan loadouts. Um, I hope you guys try these out. My favorite, my favorite game mode in the game is Last Titan Standing. That's the easiest way to get any attachment for your Titan weapons. I am telling you that. I, I know from experience. It is the easiest way to get your Titan weapon attachments. Um, I will be doing a video on pilot loadouts later this week, hopefully. Um, I'll also be doing other videos this week. I hope you guys can see those too. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, leave a like if you did. Also, if you want to see more, please hit that subscribe button. Try to hit that 1K, so I just started doing YouTube again. So, yeah, guys. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out, guys.